Hey, what's going on guys? Josh Refusion here and welcome back to another Black Ops 6 beta video. And in today's video, I'm gonna be showing you guys how to fix an error on the Black Ops 6 beta. It looks something like this. It says the application has unexpectedly stopped working. And basically you get this error whenever you're trying to launch the Black Ops 6 beta. Most times people have the crash when they're trying to launch into the Black Ops 6 beta from the COD HQ. So I wanna talk about some fixes for if you're playing on the battle.net launcher first. And then we're gonna talk about fixes for Steam. First of all, this doesn't really apply to if you're using battle.net or steam update your graphics drivers guys i know everybody says this but this is probably the most important one my game actually wouldn't launch at first before i updated to the latest graphics drivers so this was actually the fix for me once i went in and updated my graphics through geforce experience then i was able to play the black ops 6 beta and guys also before we hop into the battle.net exclusive fixes you guys want to try uninstalling face it anti-cheat if you play certain multiplayer games like CSGO or Dota 2, you might have Face It Anti-Cheat installed. And there's been issues with Face It Anti-Cheat interfering with the Black Ops 6 beta. So just try disabling it or removing it completely from your computer and see if the beta works after that. And on this same note of other apps on your PC interfering with the Black Ops 6 beta, Valorant is another one of those guys. If you have Valorant installed, uninstall it from your computer because apparently it's blocking you from being able to play black ops 6 i don't know why but this has been reported by multiple people so i thought i'd share it with you guys i'm not going to be showing how to remove these programs in the video it's pretty self-explanatory just go and uninstall them from your computer before we actually try uninstalling the beta and reinstalling it we could try verifying the game files now i have the beta installed through steam so i have to show this with cold war but you want to come down to the options little cog wheel down here next to play and there should be an option that says scan and repair it says this will perform a scan on your current game to identify missing and corrupt files you guys want to click begin scan and let this run this could definitely help you guys out your game could have installed incorrectly maybe something happened with your wi-fi when you were downloading the beta and by re-verifying the game files, this could definitely fix the beta for you guys. But if it doesn't, let's move on to our next fix. Now moving into the next fix, guys, you might want to try reinstalling the game. Just completely uninstall the game and then install it again. You could just uninstall the Black Ops 6 part of it, but keep the rest of the COD HQ installed and then just re-download the beta and see if it then lets you play. Another option is also uninstalling the battle.net launcher and reinstalling it. Sometimes there's issues with it and needs a fresh install to be able to let you play and on the same note with the battle.net launcher you can also try running it as an administrator if you guys don't know how to do that just search up battle.net in your search bar right click on it and click run as administrator this way running it with administrator privileges blocks any sort of restrictions that you might have from windows but that's pretty much all i have for you guys on how to fix the issue if the game is crashing and not launching on the battle.net launcher and guys, also before we hop into the theme specific fixes for the Black Ops 6 beta, guys, don't forget to join the Discord server. We have a ton of people in here that play Call of Duty. When you guys join, make sure you select what platform you play on. And then it's going to ask you a couple of questions to get you in the channels that you want. So make sure you select find people to play with on COD and then also choose Call of Duty. This will give you all the Call of Duty channels you guys want. People have been mad active here in the Black Ops 6 channel, so you guys want to come in here, join the party. I'm waiting to see you guys on the server. Jumping into the Steam specific fixes for the Black Ops 6 beta not working and crashing. As you guys can see, we have a crash from Steam here that says the application has unexpectedly stopped working. Allow Steam to verify the integrity of your game files the next time you start the game. Obviously, a couple of the general fixes from before still apply here to Steam. Update your graphics drivers. That's the most important thing, guys. If your graphics drivers are up to date, all right, you guys want to make sure you verify the game files here. So let's click allow verify game files. So I don't think that actually did anything. So now if you guys want to actually verify the game files inside of Steam to try to fix any glitches or errors that happened when it was installing, you want to right click on Call of Duty HQ, go down to properties, and then you want to go down into installed files and verify integrity of game files. Now guys, this might take a while, but again, this is going to sift through all of the installed files for Black Ops 6 and make sure that everything is all right. Something might have got corrupted. 
and re-verifying the game files could definitely fix that for you guys. You should also possibly try uninstalling Steam and reinstalling it because possibly Steam could be the issue here. And besides the Steam specific fixes, guys, there's only a couple more things I can think of, which could be possibly updating your Windows, your Mac OS to the latest software. Sometimes updates for your computer can be super important, having graphical updates and different things that make it important to play the newest games like the Black Ops 6 beta. So I would definitely make sure your computer is completely up to date. And one last thing that I could think of is possibly your anti-cheat software is blocking the game. So if you have some sort of anti-cheat installed Norton or just the normal Windows Defender firewall, you can actually go in there and just temporarily disable it and try to launch up Black Ops 6, see if that helps anything. And if it does, then don't leave your antivirus completely disabled. Go in there and create an exception for Black Ops 6. You can do this with every antivirus. Sometimes they accidentally detect something as malicious and it's not really. So you can go in there and tell it, hey, this is not actually a virus. I wanna keep this on my computer. And then you're all set. If it's still not working after all those fixes, you guys can try submitting a support ticket to Treyarch support. Obviously, the beta is ending here very soon, but they do have a very fast response time, so they could possibly help you guys out with a support ticket. But anyways, guys, I hope this video helps someone out there. I just wanted to give a couple fixes for Black Ops 6 beta not starting and crashing on PC. Whether you're using the Battle.net launcher or Steam, it's been happening for a ton of people, even people in my Discord server. So hey, if this video helped you guys out, drop a like on the video as well as subscribe to Fusion here for a bunch more Black Ops 6 videos coming very soon. And anyways, guys, it's been Joshua Fusion here. I'll see you guys in the next one.